Please click on subscribe button and click on bell icon for more interesting updates on civil engineering concepts. In this video lecture, I will explain you small residential building which is related to the G plus 2 building column reinforcement details, complete details about the column reinforcement details, which is having approximately 2BHK at one side and 2BHK at one side for the respected plan. Okay. So I was already explained that respected typical floor plan. Okay. In my previous video, I will show you that respected plan. So click on this respected plan option. So this is my typical floor plan which is related to the small G plus 2 building structure which is having double bedroom hall kitchen portion on the left hand side section again it is having double bedroom hall kitchen portion on the right hand side section the length of this respected building will be consisting of 67 feet 6 inches approximately which is equal to 20.57 meters and width of the building is consisting of uh, 36 feet 6 inches for this respected structure which is approximately equal to 11.13 meter okay so for this respected structure it is consisting of approximately 1 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 number of the columns will be exist for this respective structure, okay, which is having approximately the dimensions of the column for the G plus 2 structure we will consider as 12 inches cross 14 inches as per my site consideration okay so for the respected typical floor plan i was taken 12 inches cross 14 inches is the dimensions of the column cross section of the column as per the project requirement okay so before going to explaining the reinforcement details for the respected column section initially i will explain you the specification which are taken for this respected project so for that select this uh, word document so it is consisting of all the building specifications like the grade of the concrete, grade of the steel and the size of the column, soil bearing capacity and number of columns in each floor. Okay. So for this building G plus 2 structure, I was consider the grade of the concrete is M25 grade concrete and grade of the steel is FE415 grade steel and the size of the column will be consisting of approximately 12 inches cross 14 inches size and soil bearing capacity as per the site requirement, it is consisting of 200 value and the number of the columns in each floor will be consisting of 18 numbers so if you want to calculate the total number of the columns then it will be equal to 18 multiplied by your respected 3 which is approximately equal to 54 number of the columns will be exist for this structure okay in each floor it will be consisting of 18 number of the columns okay now i will show you the complete reinforcement details for the respected uh, column section which is comes under the g plus 2 structural model which is equals to first floor section and uh, which is having ground floor section and first floor section and second floor section okay click on this pdf option and click on this G plus 2 building reinforcement details option here. Okay. So this is the ground floor section reinforcement details and this is the first floor section reinforcement details. Okay. Which is consisting of 18 number of the columns and this is the second floor column reinforcement details. Okay. So for the first floor section, it will be consisting of the column numbers as C1, C2, C3, C4, C5, C6 here. Okay. So C1 is nothing but the column which is exist in this respected section row. Okay. So the cross section of the column will be same for this respected three sections. So that's why we are taking the notation as c1 here and c2 here and c3 here c4 here c5 here and c6 here okay so for the respected c1 section which is equals to three number of the columns so the ground floor reinforcement values will be exist here like this okay these are the six number of the columns and this is the reinforcement details for the six number of the columns okay so for the respected c1 section it is consisting of approximately uh, 12 inches cross 14 inches is the dimensions of the column section which is having three number of the columns will be exist in this respected row okay so for this respected row number of the columns it is required 8 number of the bars which is located here as red color mark which is having 16 mm diameter for the each bar okay again it will be consisting of the ring beam section here which is nothing but your respected ring beam section here like this and which is having 8 mm diameter bar for the respected ring beam section which is having 7 inches center to center distance for this respected ring beam okay so the ring beam size will be consisting of approximately 230 mm cross 280 mm 230 mm will be located in horizontal direction distance and 280 mm distance will be provided in vertical direction distance okay so this is the reinforcement details for the c1 section again for the c2 section it is required eight number of the bars which is of 16 mm diameter and the ring beam section is required 8 mm bars with 7 center to center distance for this respected section okay for the stirrups and ring beam will be consisting of the size is approximately equal to 230 mm cross 280 mm for this respected consideration okay again for the c3 section also it is consisting of the same number of the reinforcement and uh, values which is of 8 mm diameter 8 number of the bars which is of 16 mm diameter main bus and stirrups will be consisting of 8 mm diameter bar with 7 center to center distance and ring beam will be consisting of 230 mm 
across 280 mm size and for the c4 section also c5 section also it is consisting of the same number of the reinforcement values which is of 8 number of the bars of 16 mm diameter and ring beam will be consisting of 8 mm diameter bar with 7 center to center distance and ring beam is also consisting of the size is approximately 230 mm cross 280 mm this respected ground floor reinforcement values will be applicable if the if you consider the reinforcement uh, grade of the concrete is m25 grade concrete and fe 405 grade steel and which is having the column size is approximately of 12 inches cross 14 inches and soil bearing capacity is 200 and for uh, 80 number of the columns okay so now i will show you the reinforcement details for the first floor section so these are the first floor reinforcement detail section it is, it is also consisting of c1 section c2 section c3 section c4 section and c5 section and c6 section so for the respected first floor section also it is consisting of the typical floor plan is same which is having double bedroom hall kitchen portion on the left hand side section again it is having double bedroom hall kitchen portion on the right hand side section for this respected building okay so for this building it is consisting of approximately of uh, c1 section which is of same number of the uh, dimensions for the respected column which is approximately of 12 inches cross 14 inches which is having the three numbers okay one two three is the three numbers okay so for this respected section it is consisting of eight number of the bars of 16 mm diameter for the main bar section again it will be consisting of the ring beam section which is consisting of 8 mm diameter bar with seven inches center to center distance for the each bar in the uh, stirrup section okay so for this respected c1 section it is required 230 mm cross 280 mm cross section ring beam okay so again for the c2 section and c3 section c4 section c5 section and c6 section it is also consisting of the same amount of the reinforcement values which is consisting of eight number of the 16 mm diameter main bar section which is located as the red color mark here again it will be consisting of stirrups of 8 mm diameter bar with seven inches center to center distance for the each stirrup section okay so for this respected column section it is required 230 mm cross 280 mm ring beam size okay which is having the dimensions is approximately 230 cross 280 mm which is of 12 inches cross 14 inches column size okay so now i will explain you the complete reinforcement details for the second floor section so for the second floor section is also it is consisting of the typical floor plan here like this which is having the left hand side will be of double bedroom hall kitchen portion and right hand section will be of double bedroom hall kitchen portion so as per the considerations of the typical floor plan it is also consisting of c1 c2 c3 c4 c5 c6 section in the respected row numbers here like this which is of three numbers in the each row which is approximately consisting of 60 number of the columns okay for the c1 section it is required eight number of the bar 16 mm diameter bar for the respected section which is consisting of m25 grade concrete fe 405 grade steel and the soil bearing capacity is 200 for the respected section okay again it will be consisting of ring beam of 8 mm diameter bar with seven inches center to center distance for this respected bar again for the respected bar it is consisting of the reinforcement uh, stirrup size of 230 mm cross 280 mm for this respected section okay so as per the stat output file we are obtained that for this respected building it is required eight number of the bars which is of 12 mm diameter bar but in actual condition that 12 mm bar is not sufficient for the manual calculations so that's why we are changing that the respected 12 mm bar size to 16 mm diameter bar okay so again for the 8 mm uh, stirrup section it is also consisting of approximately i was obtained as 8 inches center to center distance for the respected stirrup section but as per my consideration as per the building safety i was taken 7 inches for the respected center to center distance okay so this is the complete reinforcement details of g plus 2 a residential building for the construction of uh, your respected building under the specified specifications for the structure okay so i will provide you this respected pdf in the below description of this respected video you can download easily and you can uh, observe the values for the respected reinforcement details okay so if you have any queries about this respected video please text me your questions in the below comment box i will try to give the answer for the respected questions okay thank you